Today we're going to take a tour of the Ballantrae Golf Course here in Pelham. The Ballantrae Golf Course is a par 72, over 7,000 yards of fairways and greens that includes 18 beautiful holes of golf. We're going to meet with Hal Brown to tour the clubhouse, which includes the golf shop, restaurant, and conference room. And then we'll take you on a tour of the golf course. Hey, I'm Paul Howell with the Howell Group of Keller Williams, and we're here today at Ballantrae Golf Course with the manager, Hal Brown. Hey, Paul, Hal. welcome to Ballantrae. Thank you. Hal, we're in the pro shop now, and, and this is a place that I use myself. Anytime I need shoes, socks, golf balls, or any type of equipment, this is where I get it to include shirts. <laughs> yeah, the great thing about us being owned by the city of Pelham is that we don't have to charge sales tax. And that includes any merchandise, dues, or fees with membership here at Ballantrae. But yeah, this is a spot where everybody comes in, they'll book their tea time in advance, and they'll come in to check in for the round of golf, and hopefully they'll purchase a little merchandise and get ready for the round. I can tell you I've enjoyed this for almost 15 years now and the course gets better each and every year as well as the merchandise here in the pro shop. We're in the Fireside Grill now. Hal, tell us a little bit about this. Yeah, the Fireside Grill, it's available to uh, really everyone that comes out to Ballantrae. The neighborhood and the customers that play here at Ballantrae, uh, we serve uh, breakfast and lunch and lunch continues into the afternoon. Uh, we have a wonderful Saturday morning breakfast buffet that's really good. Also, with this room, it seats up to 60 people, so we're able to rent it out after golfing hours. Works really well for parties, especially rehearsal dinners. Uh, so, a very quaint little setting for this. This is beautiful, and I can tell you from my own experience, the food here is great. I've enjoyed breakfasts and lunch, and even dinners here. So, this is a fantastic uh, site and a well-kept secret here in Pelham. How long well we go outside sure, and see out there? We've got a beautiful view of the 18th, as well as a nice sitting area to come enjoy the 19th hole. Yeah, we added the little canopy here to extend the, the space for those who like to come out here and eat, and a beautiful view. And we've got the fans running, nice cool breeze. This Wonderful is extremely spot. nice. Hal, tell us about this room. This is our conference room, and it's available to rent uh, all during the day, and it will seat uh, up to 20 people. Uh, it works great for small groups that will come in and uh, have a little board meeting in the morning, and then we can pre order lunch for them and then hopefully they'll play a little golf right after. So it uh, really works well, it's got a projection screen and uh, it's very cozy at the same time, uh, really works well for, for those side members. This is really, really nice. And I was making a note to Hal that when the Pelham City School Board officially formed back in 2014, we actually had our first meeting here. Yeah, that's great. We use it for staff meetings and uh, we've had a lot of success with this is beautiful. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. This is one of the views from the balcony. We're driving out to the driving range right now where we'll meet up with Hal Brown and Hal's going to talk to us about membership and golf lessons. Hal, tell us a little bit about membership. With Valentray being a semi-private facility, which means we're open to the public, but at the same time, we're, we have memberships available. It's an annual membership, and we also have categories for individual and family members. With membership, you get advanced tee times and other amenities here at the club, and the opportunity to play a lot of golf. And I will tell you that the Saturday morning dog fight is something that all the neighbors enjoy doing it's a great time to get out play around the golf get to know your neighbors a little bit better and really enjoy all the hospitality that's offered here at Ballantrae golf course but here we are on the driving range and Hal has helped me 
with my golf game, whether it be my driver, my short game, my iron game, or my putting over the years. So, Hal, tell us what y'all offer here. Sure, sure. Well, golf instruction is a, it's a passion for the professional staff here at Ballantrae. We have PGA professionals available to give golf instruction. And we do individual group lessons and also along with uh, clinics. And that includes uh, summer junior clinics, uh, PGA Junior League, which is T-ball for, for golf. <laughs> and uh, in addition, again, being open to the public, you know, have a great, great practice facility with four different practice screens and a large driving range. Hal is one of the originals here. Matter of fact, really one of the only originals left here. Hal started here in 2004 when the club first opened and has progressed his way up to the general manager position today. Hal, we're so thankful to have you here yes, with us. Yeah, thank you, Paul. Thanks thank for you. coming today. Absolutely. We're on the seventh hole today. This is a par five. The key to this par five, as well as most par fives, is getting a good drive off of the tee box. This is a wide open fairway with lots of room to hit the ball. If you're left, you may end up with a hillside. If you're right, you could potentially be in the trees. If you can just stay in the middle, whether your drive is 225 or 275, you're setting yourself up for a great second shot. This is typically the landing areas for most amateurs. You've got an easy three wood or three iron to within a hundred yards of the green. You want to stay out of the fairway bunker as much as possible. For most of us, most of us, it's out of reach from the drive. But if you can, you can go left or right around it. From there, you have a pitching wedge into a small green that is sloped. It is critical to get a good shot because putting on this green is extremely difficult. If you can come away with a par, you should consider yourself a good golfer. We're on the eighth hole now. This is a par three. What makes this hole challenging is the fact that it plays in between 180 and 210 yards. So your tee shot has got to be on the green in order to two putt this hole. Here in Ballantrae, they feature two driving ranges. One at the far end near the clubhouse that you can use. Others for members only can come down and have a little bit smaller driving range to use. There are an ample supply of homes here in the Ballantrae subdivision. Thanks for touring the Ballantrae Golf Course with us today. Please see the description below for more information. Leave us a comment with any questions that you have. We'll have a new video for you next Wednesday.